Fear is a universal emotion that has the power to either cripple us or propel us forward. In the realm of self-improvement and personal growth, learning to overcome fear is a fundamental skill. There are few individuals in history who embody the essence of mastering fear as profoundly as the legendary Japanese swordsman, Miyamoto Musashi. His life and teachings offer a rich source of inspiration and guidance for those seeking to conquer their own fears and limitations. In this video, we will delve into the wisdom of Miyamoto Musashi, dissecting his philosophy and martial prowess, and revealing how his principles can be applied to conquer fear in all aspects of life. We will cover a wide range of topics, including understanding the nature of fear, the mindset required to overcome it, and practical strategies for doing so. Musashi's timeless teachings will serve as our guiding light, illuminating the path to fearlessness and personal growth. Before we can tackle the art of overcoming fear, it is crucial to understand what fear is and how it operates in our lives. Musashi believed that to defeat an opponent, one must first comprehend their strengths and weaknesses. Similarly, to overcome fear, we must recognize its nature. Fear is a fundamental human emotion that has evolved as a survival mechanism. It often manifests as a response to perceived threats, whether physical or psychological. While our ancestors needed fear to fend off predators and survive harsh environments, modern society presents us with a different set of challenges. Do nothing that is of no use. Musashi's philosophy encourages us to examine our fears critically. Are they rooted in real dangers or are they merely figments of our imagination? Understanding the source of our fears is the first step towards overcoming them. Fear can paralyze us, preventing us from taking action and realizing our potential. It is the invisible force that keeps us in our comfort zones and hinders personal growth. To master fear, we must break free from this paralysis. Perceive that which cannot be seen with the eye. Musashi's words remind us that fear often stems from our perception of the unknown. By shedding light on the unseen, we can reduce the power of fear and take meaningful steps forward. Now that we have a deeper understanding of fear, it's time to explore the mindset that Miyamoto Musashi cultivated to become a fearless warrior and philosopher. Musashi's mindset is a treasure trove of wisdom that can be applied to overcome fear in our lives. One of the key aspects of Musashi's mindset is his emphasis on detachment. He believed that by detaching from outcomes and focusing on the process, one can attain a state of fearlessness. Do not seek pleasure for its own sake. Musashi's philosophy encourages us to embrace detachment from the fear of failure. When we cease to seek pleasure in success and instead focus on the journey itself, fear of failure loses its grip on us. Miyamoto Musashi was a strong advocate for self-reliance. He believed in honing one's skills and relying on one's own abilities. This self-reliance is a powerful antidote to the fear of depending on others or external circumstances. You can only fight the way you practice. To master fear, we must cultivate the self-reliance to confront our fears head-on. Musashi's teachings underscore the importance of consistent practice to build the inner strength needed to face our fears. Strategies for Overcoming Fear With the foundation of understanding fear and cultivating the mindset of fearlessness in place, it's time to delve into practical strategies for overcoming fear. Musashi's life and teachings offer valuable insights into how we can navigate the challenges fear presents. Miyamoto Musashi's most famous work, The Book of Five Rings, is a profound exploration of strategy. In this book, he outlines principles that are applicable not only in martial arts, but also in life. The primary thing when you take a sword in your hands is your intention to cut the enemy, whatever the means. The application of strategy is not limited to the battlefield. Musashi's advice can be used to conquer fear. When we face our fears with unwavering intent, we are more likely to overcome them. Musashi often reflected on the transience of life and the inevitability of death. While this might seem like a morbid perspective, it can be a powerful tool in overcoming fear. By accepting the impermanence of life, we can become fearless in the face of adversity. The way of the warrior is resolute acceptance of death. 
This concept is not about seeking death but understanding its presence and embracing life fully. By acknowledging the fragility of existence, we can develop a fearlessness that allows us to take bold risks and pursue our dreams. Mastery over fear requires rigorous training and discipline. Musashi's life was a testament to the importance of constant self-improvement and honing one's skills. You must understand that there is more than one path to the top of the mountain. Fear often stems from our insecurities and limitations. By continuously seeking improvement and exploring different paths, we can gain the confidence to overcome fear. Fear in everyday life. Fear is not limited to life and death situations or martial encounters. It can manifest in everyday life, affecting our decisions, relationships, and well-being. Musashi's wisdom extends to these aspects as well. Overcoming social fear. Many people struggle with social fear, which can manifest as shyness, anxiety, or self-doubt in social situations. Musashi's teachings on fearlessness offer guidance in overcoming these barriers. From one thing, no 10,000 things. By focusing on mastering one aspect of social interaction, we can gain confidence and competence, ultimately reducing social fear. Fear of failure. The fear of failure often holds people back from pursuing their dreams. Musashi's philosophy encourages us to view failure as a stepping stone to success. Do not regret what you have done. In this, Musashi teaches us not to dwell on our failures but to learn from them. Failure is a valuable teacher, and by embracing it, we can conquer the fear of falling short. Miyamoto Musashi's life was marked by numerous challenges, both on and off the battlefield. His ability to overcome adversity and maintain resilience is a testament to his fearless spirit. Musashi faced defeat early in his life, which served as a catalyst for his growth and eventual mastery. He did not allow defeat to define him. Instead, he used it as a platform for learning and self-improvement. In strategy, your worst enemy is yourself. The fear of failure often stems from self-doubt and self-sabotage. By recognizing that we are our own worst enemy, we can begin to conquer fear and rise above our limitations. The ability to adapt to change is a hallmark of resilience. Musashi's life was marked by constant change and adaptation to new circumstances. Perceive that which cannot be seen with the eye. Adapting to the unseen is an essential skill in overcoming fear. Change can be a source of fear, but by perceiving and adapting to it, we can embrace new opportunities and experiences. The path to fearlessness. The path to fearlessness is not a one-time endeavor, but a lifelong journey. Miyamoto Musashi's philosophy provides us with a roadmap for mastering fear and achieving a state of fearlessness. Miyamoto Musashi embodied the warrior spirit throughout his life. He believed that anyone, regardless of their chosen path, could embrace this spirit and become a fearless warrior in their own right. You can only fight the way you practice. To become a fearless warrior, we must practice fearlessness in our daily lives. Whether we are a martial artist, a teacher, a doctor, or an artist, we can adopt Musashi's principles and practice them consistently. Musashi's concept of the way emphasizes finding balance in all aspects of life. Balance is essential for maintaining a fearless mindset and navigating challenges with grace. The true science of martial arts means practicing them in such a way that they will be useful at any time, and to teach them in such a way that they will be useful in all things. Balance is about applying the principles of fearlessness to all areas of life. It is the key to mastering fear and living with purpose and courage. Applying Musashi's teachings. Now that we have explored the philosophy and wisdom of Miyamoto Musashi in depth, it's time to apply these teachings to our own lives. Here, we'll discuss practical steps and strategies for incorporating Musashi's principles into daily life. Meditation and Mindfulness Meditation and mindfulness are tools that Musashi used to develop his inner strength and focus. These practices can help us overcome fear by cultivating self-awareness and emotional control. You should not have any special fondness for a particular weapon, or anything else, for that matter. 
By detaching from our fears and anxieties through meditation and mindfulness, we can approach life's challenges with a clear and focused mind. Physical Fitness Miyamoto Musashi placed a strong emphasis on physical fitness and martial training. Maintaining good physical health is crucial for building the strength and confidence needed to face fear. Do nothing that is of no use. Physical fitness is not only about enhancing our physical abilities, but also about building resilience and fearlessness. A strong body often leads to a strong mind. Setting and Pursuing Goals Miyamoto Musashi's unwavering dedication to his goals is a testament to the power of setting and pursuing objectives. Setting clear, meaningful goals can help us overcome fear by giving us a sense of purpose and direction. The true science of martial arts means practicing them in such a way that they will be useful at any time. To master fear, it's essential to practice and apply Musashi's teachings in our daily lives. By setting goals and consistently working toward them, we can make meaningful progress on the path to fearlessness. Miyamoto Musashi's teachings and legacy continue to inspire people around the world. Fearlessness is not a destination but a journey. Musashi's legacy teaches us that the path of self-improvement and fearlessness is ongoing and ever-evolving. You should not have any special fondness for a particular weapon, or anything else, for that matter. Just as Musashi had no special fondness for a particular weapon, we should have no special fondness for our fears. We must continue to refine our understanding and conquer new fears as they arise. Miyamoto Musashi's life and philosophy have the power to inspire others to overcome their fears and limitations. As we apply his teachings, we can become beacons of hope and courage for those around us. From one thing, no 10,000 things. By applying Musashi's principles and sharing our knowledge, we can help others overcome their fears and navigate life's challenges with resilience and strength. One cannot delve into the teachings of Miyamoto Musashi without exploring his prowess as a swordsman. Musashi was not only a philosopher, but also a master of the martial arts, particularly the way of the sword. His exceptional skills and insights into combat can be translated into valuable lessons for conquering fear in our lives. Miyamoto Musashi's legendary duels and victories on the battlefield serve as a metaphor for confronting our fears. In the world of martial arts, the sword symbolizes the challenges and adversaries we face in life. Just as Musashi met his opponents with a fearless heart, we can confront our fears with the same determination. The true science of martial arts means practicing them in such a way that they will be useful at any time. To overcome fear, we must practice and prepare ourselves for any challenge, just as a martial artist hones their skills to be ready for any opponent. Fear, like a sword, has two edges. It can both protect and hinder us. In a protective sense, fear can act as a warning signal, alerting us to potential dangers. However, it can also become a hindrance, preventing us from taking necessary risks and seizing opportunities. There is nothing outside of yourself that can ever enable you to get better, stronger, richer, quicker, or smarter. Everything is within. Everything exists. Seek nothing outside of yourself. Miyamoto Musashi's wisdom encourages us to look within ourselves for the strength and courage to confront fear. By recognizing that everything we need already exists within us, we can wield fear like a double-edged sword, using it to our advantage. Miyamoto Musashi was not only a fearsome warrior, but also a philosopher and a leader. His wisdom transcends the martial arts and can guide us in becoming fearless leaders in our respective fields and communities. Musashi's life exemplified leading by example. He did not just preach his philosophy, he lived it. As leaders, we can inspire others to overcome their fears by setting an example of fearlessness through our actions. You should not have any special fondness for a particular weapon, or anything else, for that matter. Leaders must remain adaptable and open-minded, not becoming attached to a single way of thinking. This approach can help us become fearless in the face of change and uncertainty, inspiring others to do the same. A fearless leader is also skilled at nurturing fearless teams. 
Musashi's wisdom extends to building and leading teams, fostering an environment where every member can overcome their fears and achieve their full potential. From one thing, no 10,000 things. A leader who can perceive the unseen potential in their team members and inspire them to reach new heights is a true exemplar of fearlessness. In a rapidly changing world, the philosophy of fearlessness from Miyamoto Musashi remains as relevant as ever. Let's explore how we can apply these ancient principles in the context of our modern lives. The digital age has introduced new forms of fear, such as the fear of missing out, FOMO, fear of cyberbullying, and fear of digital overwhelm. Musashi's philosophy equips us to overcome these modern fears by emphasizing the importance of inner strength and adaptability. Do nothing that is of no use. In a digital world filled with distractions, we can apply Musashi's teachings to focus on meaningful activities and avoid the paralysis caused by information overload. The pace of change and uncertainty in the modern world can be overwhelming. Musashi's wisdom guides us to embrace change, perceiving the unseen opportunities that lie within it. Perceive that which cannot be seen with the eye. In times of uncertainty, the ability to perceive and adapt to the unseen becomes an invaluable skill. Fearlessness is born from our capacity to adapt to change and navigate the unknown with confidence. Musashi's insights are not confined to the past, but are living principles that can shape the future. By instilling the values of courage, self-reliance, and adaptability in the next generation, we can prepare them to overcome their fears and seize opportunities. Do not regret what you have done. Teaching children to learn from their mistakes and not to dwell on regret is a priceless gift. It equips them with the resilience to face fear head-on and persevere. Just as Musashi's teachings continue to inspire individuals around the world, we too can share his philosophy with a global audience. By spreading the wisdom of fearlessness, we can create a more fearless and courageous world. From one thing, no 10,000 things. By sharing Musashi's principles, we can help people from diverse backgrounds and cultures discover the timeless truths that can lead to a life free from the shackles of fear. The journey towards fearlessness, as outlined by Miyamoto Musashi, is a path that requires patience, perseverance, and dedication. It's a journey that begins with a single step as you take the wisdom of Musashi to heart and apply it in your daily life. Now we'll discuss the practical steps you can take to embark on your own journey towards mastering fear. The first step on your fearless journey is self-reflection. Take a moment to examine your life and identify the fears that hold you back. Are they related to your career, relationships, or personal growth? By acknowledging your fears, you can begin the process of conquering them. You should not have any special fondness for a particular weapon, or anything else, for that matter. Just as Musashi advocated detachment from attachments, you must detach from your fears. Recognize them as separate from your true self, and refuse to give them power over your decisions and actions. Setting clear and meaningful goals is a critical part of your journey towards fearlessness. These goals will serve as guiding lights, helping you navigate the challenges and uncertainties that lie ahead. The true science of martial arts means practicing them in such a way that they will be useful at any time. Set your goals in a way that makes them relevant to every aspect of your life. Whether it's in your career, relationships, or personal development, Ensure that your goals are aligned with the principles of fearlessness. Fearlessness is not an attribute you can acquire overnight. It requires consistent practice and the integration of Musashi's teachings into your daily life. You can only fight the way you practice. Practice fearlessness in every situation you encounter. When faced with fear, remind yourself of Musashi's principles and act accordingly. With time and practice, you'll find that fear loses its grip on you. Miyamoto Musashi's journey towards fearlessness was not a solitary one. He learned from masters, engaged in duels, and sought mentorship throughout his life. You, too, can benefit from the guidance and mentorship of those who have already walked the path you're embarking on. In strategy, your worst enemy is yourself. Seek out mentors and guides who can help you identify your inner obstacles and guide you towards overcoming them. 
Their insights and experiences can be invaluable on your fearless journey. As you progress on your fearless journey, you will undoubtedly encounter failure. Musashi's philosophy encourages us not to regret our failures but to learn from them. Do not regret what you have done. Embrace failure as a stepping stone towards growth and mastery. Each setback is an opportunity to develop resilience and to confront fear with even greater determination. Your fearless journey doesn't end with your own personal growth. As you conquer your fears and master the principles of fearlessness, you become an inspiration to others. From one thing, know 10,000 things. Share your knowledge and experiences with those around you. Your journey can ignite the spark of courage in others, empowering them to overcome their fears and live with purpose. Miyamoto Musashi's teachings on fearlessness have stood the test of time and remain as relevant today as they were in his era. His wisdom serves as a guide for those who seek to conquer their fears, embrace change, and lead lives of courage and purpose. Your fearless journey begins with an understanding of fear, a commitment to self-improvement, and the willingness to apply Musashi's teachings in your daily life. It is a lifelong journey that leads to a life of boundless courage and limitless potential. In the words of Miyamoto Musashi, you can only fight the way you practice. Practice fearlessness in your life, one step at a time, and you will overcome fear, embracing a life of fearlessness, resilience, and unshakable determination. Your journey is just beginning, and the path to fearlessness is open before you.